tell me a little bit about yourself and the car? Hi, my name is Randy Yalling. I'm from Shanahan, Illinois. My car is two 1953 vehicles put together as one. The front part is a 53 Chevy. The back part is a 53 Pontiac. It has a stock original 235 six straight six cylinder engine for the Chevy, three, three speed on the column. And the back has no engine at all. It's just mocked up, but it does have a full dashboards uh, front and back. And the back is now a trunk where the engine compartment actually was. Can you tell me a little about the purchase of this car? Yeah, I had a 1951 Chevy. I purchased that back to the 50s. I brought it home. Gentleman seen it on the internet and said that was like his father's car and he wanted to know if I wanted to trade. He sent me a picture of one of the front ends of the car. I don't remember which one with the mag wheels. He was in Louisiana. I said, sure, I might be interested in a trade. Didn't get a whole picture of the car until we met in Arkansas and he pulled us out of the trailer and I noticed it had two front ends. And I told him basically I didn't want it. It was a clown car. And he made it worth my while and we ended up doing the trade and here it is. I like kind of odd and weird vehicles. So the more I have it, the more I like it. And it definitely is a conversation piece. You don't see one every day. And I definitely won't uh, get in the wrong car at a car show. All right, thank you. You're welcome. It's like riding in reverse. Ain't it? For me, yeah. Well, three on a tree, is yep. it? Or? Three on the tree. You've got to get a lot of stairs in this thing. <laughs> kind of weird, you can almost act like you're driving it. Yeah. Oh, get out of here a little bit. It actually rides pretty good. It don't ride too bad. You slow down, I'm going for the break. Yeah, you know what I mean? You want to grab it, yeah. It's like you feel like you're driving it, though. Yeah, absolutely. I got a little bit of something behind us, anyways. I can't imagine pulling up behind this thing. But I'm correct. 